Hey, how's it going? Joe here. I uh, want to do a quick video today. Just kind of tell you what's been going on and go over a new piece of gear I got. I've been planning a trip to do the West Rim Trail on the Pennsylvania Grand Canyon. Um, if you haven't seen it or don't know what it is, check it out. I mean, it, it is a really nice trail. It's a 32 mile, 30 mile, but two mile back to the car through hike. Basically what you do is you, we're going to go out, we're going to get dropped off. Um, we're going to park in the parking lot, take the shuttle around, get dropped off, and then hike ourselves back 30 miles, plus two on the road, to the car. So, um, I'm really looking forward to it. It's going to be late May, early June, somewhere around there. No, no deadlock on anything yet. But anyway, I've been, uh, I got a new piece of gear that's lightweight because I'm doing such the long hike. I want to make sure it's going to be a 16 mile one day, spend a night 16 mile out. So, um been trying to get some lighter gear together we do a lot of hiking but um you know nothing no, nothing really light i have so i'm switching switching gears to go to that so um what i'm going to show you today is the brs it's the brs i always want to say bsr but the brs 3000 and what this is is my stove so you want to check this out stick with me This, well first, this is what I used to use. This is the MSR Pocket Rocket. This is a awesome, awesome stove. I'm not gonna say anything bad about it, other than it being huge. Very reliable, good stove. I mean, this, this treated me well for a long time. Like I say, I've used this many times and it's a great stove. But in comparison, let's have a look. And now granted, this is folded up, but still, I mean, even in comparison, it's insane. It's insane. So let's go over that one for a second. And here, this comes in this nice holder, nice case. It really is. This truly is a nice piece. But here is my Tokes titanium can. I can't even get that in. And you'll see this just falls in. So let's go over this real fast. Um, first of all, the weights. I'll show you the weights. All right, let's check this weight. We've got 26 grams, 0.57 pounds, or 0.9 ounces. The bag, 0.06 ounces. So that is light, I mean, that is light. You can see it here in my hand. And then we'll look here, and this is how this operates. You flip these handles up like so. Now if you look right here, you'll see that little pin. Well, they all kind of lock down. Let's see, lock it down, and lock it down. And then you just screw it onto this canister. And instead of taking the alcohol stove, I'm just gonna take this, and here's why. The alcohol stove sure might be lighter, but um, bowl time, like if I stop for lunch, the boil time in this is going to be like two or three minutes where the alcohol stove can take five to ten. So sometimes it's worth the best though. But anyway, let's get this fired up here. Alright. You turn this little knob. And as you can see, I mean she cranks, and here's how the pot sits. Again, I mean, this is just an awesome, awesome little stove. Fold it back down. Let's kind of fold this up. And everything comes down. Tilt this over. And back in the bag. Like I say, this is the BRS 3000. Let me show you. Let's tighten this down. Again, if you look into my can, I have the Tokes Titanium. Inside here, I've got a chamois, a small lighter, and a full can. Put all this back together. 
put this in here. I mean, literally, look at that. I mean, I could actually take some Esbit tablets as a backup stove. There's a small Esbit stove that I have. Um, tiny. It will fit right in there as a backup. And where I couldn't even get this one in there before. So, definitely, definitely a nice stove. Again, I haven't used it other than, you know, what I just showed you here. This one very reliable. Everything I've seen or read about this on the internet and fellow hikers, um, everybody says good things about it. So one person told me they had this. Um, one video was talking about they had this on the entire trip of the Appalachian Trail, 2188 miles or whatever that is, and uh, never had a fail. That's what I'm hoping for. I'm hoping. Uh, to get out there and not have any issues with it again it cuts the weight down the weight loss i mean weight savings is incredible so maybe i'll do a video on this whole canister setup so you can do your mountain house meals or ramen or whatever you want to do you can cook in this pot too off of this and it's going to bring water to a bowl in about two or three minutes so good deal here is the package I mean, it's, there's no hiding. This is a Chinese-made product. Um, again, it is what it is. I, I prefer to find and use American-made products, but, I mean, like I say, it is what it is. This is a great little stove, and uh, I'm going to put it through its paces. I'm definitely going to have trips before I go um, on my big trip, but uh, that's the one I'm carrying. It would have been this one. Again, I'm not saying anything. Please don't say uh, anything bad in the bottom about the MSR. It's a great... Um, it was a great stove. It's a great stove. But I'm going to give this one a try. So, if you have any questions concerning it or anything like that, or even if you want to know anything about the um, Western Trail, you know, guess in the bottom. Also, hit the subscribe button. That way you can find out what we'll be doing because summertime's coming up. We're getting ready to do the trail. Um, the kayak's getting geared up. Um, I'm getting ready to put my GPS onto the kayak. I'm not my GPS, my fish finder on the kayak. That's going to be a video coming soon. Um, I have the stand-up bar already mounted. Check for that video. Um, search me. Find my video of the stand-up bar for the kayak. Um, I also have the box the my tackle box is mounted on it and i'm also waiting for a rudder so good things are coming for the kayak i can't wait until the weather changes funny thing is in february in pennsylvania where i'm at it was 75 degrees last month this month give me a second and this is after it's been melting what is 16 16 to 18 inches of snow the other day and then just yesterday i woke up to three more inches of snow but cool thing about that is, is by like 11 o'clock, all the three inches of snow had melted back down to the original amount, and it's just melting like crazy. So bring on spring. I'm just a spring-loving guy. I know people um, depend on winter. I get that, and uh, they love winter. I'm just not that guy. So uh, um, hopefully you'll stick around. Like I say, sub, and look for the new videos. I'm planning on just, just doing a bunch of whatevers and doing what I can, and Um, and just trying to, uh, to make good videos. When I do discuss, I will discuss this bag whenever I talk about this in my, one of my videos. Eh, the bag is alright, but here, let me just show you this right here also. Um, this is going to be my cook kit. Bingo. Lightweight. Nice cook kit. So, like I say, if you have any questions, go below. Hit the sub button. Look for some new videos that I'm putting out. And, um... Thanks a lot, as always. I appreciate the views. I appreciate the likes. Um, and just every time I see somebody like something or uh, a new sub, it makes me feel cool about doing the videos. And like I say, I enjoy doing these things. So we'll see you around. Thanks a lot again.